Welcome back everyone, Lightwalks here with another episode of Lufia 2 Rise of the Sinner Strolls. Now you're probably been wondering what this bad news could be about. Who knows? I can't think of anything clever, but it's probably pretty bad. So bad I'm gonna make you stare at okay. Everyone get her. What is it? Horde monsters appear in the cave on the way to Subleton. You didn't get the hint about the monsters there already? Are you sure about that? Oh, the guy. Uh, he's a very feminine guy. <laughs> That's horrible. The worst you said you're doing. These evil monsters will come to the city too? I don't think they will, but unfortunately, it's not the only thing we've got on our hands. What do you mean? <sighs> the monsters have closed the door at the back of the cave. You can't get to settle them without the key. That's not good. No, it's very good. Jeez, I'm just... So does anyone have any ideas about what we should do? I may be a smart old man, but I don't have the skills for this. No, no, I, I don't. I'm just gonna walk away and hope no one kicks me. Tia looks very concerned. Yes, yes, we should say that. No, I got nothing. I don't want anything. Go make me your prize to fish. Oh, no. Sure, that monster's kid in her yeah, I'm gonna get him. Oh, I'm gonna get him. First, I'm not worried about anything really. I'm gonna get a sob. Wow. Wow. It's only looks like I've been along and I really haven't. Jeez, spending an hour doing nothing? Can we cross the bridge? What happens when we cross the bridge? I always think there's a secret, but I'm not. Too bad. 
I don't need a depression. I don't want to die. I'm going on. Yeah, yeah, you go back and you go mushroom. Honestly, I'm not as strong as a bunch of mushrooms. disrupting human life. Keyless. I just don't get it. This has never happened before. And enter the mysterious lady. Who's definitely not creepy. Do you wish to 
in a Y, right? Uh, who are you? How did you know my name? It's right there, you little bad. It tells you who you are. Ah. Mm. I can see the future. Chip, call. I know your name and why you come here. Just, who are you? Never mind. Don't you want to know why monsters are smart and attacking humans? You know why? Because I can take a few guesses. Are you aware of the ball of red light that appeared a couple of days ago? You mean it's because of that red ball? Everything that's happened is because of it because of that light. That doesn't make sense. What? I can't believe I'm like, all of light has that kind of power. I understand your doubt. It is incredible, but true. Time is going to change. Now a mere wife, later a dream, can take soil while you attack the humanity. Deep. That's ridiculous. Why are you telling me this? Because you have the power. The one. The power to confront that soil. Me? Yes. You. Wait a minute. It's true that fighting is my job and eating, you know, the killer eater. I know, but I don't have that great power. Such a good power, no. Oh, the silent treatment. Jeez, what a great first date. What is this ball of light anyway? Is it monster or human? Yay, more silence. You're so... I need to know! What can I do against this humongous enemy of all humanity? Not just you. There are others in this world that can confront this evil power. You just need to go on a journey to meet those people and fight against evil. A journey to fight. That's right. When that ball of light appeared, your destiny was sealed. Did that ball of light really bring misfortune? And I have the power to handle that. This is all I can tell you. Oh, okay. You didn't tell me much anyways. Whether or not you beat me and go on a journey is totally up to you. Yeah, because the plot would not prevent me from doing what I want. Wait! My name is Iris. I'm here to ascertain your future. If you go, we may meet again. Better damn well that I'm gone to see your pretty face again. Yeah. Alright. I think that's all we'll be doing for this one. We'll continue on in the next episode. So, again, thank you for watching and bearing through with this as a the lag and the quality. It's, we'll get better. Just trust me. One thing at a time. I'm getting it. I promise. I promise. But lately, some very hard things have been happening to a few people. Recently, Mark Meyer. I'm a big fan of his. If you can't tell, that kind of motivated me to actually get into this kind of thing. Something... Lost a dear friend, and that means we all has lost. We all have lost a dear friend. I don't know how to really console with the whole loss. I don't know Daniel personally or anything. I just hope we can all find a way to keep him in our hearts and memories and honor him in whatever way we can. And I don't know what drove him to it, but I pray that we can move along and hopefully. Things will be better for all of us, and that we can find the comfort to overcome this. Well, thank you for watching. I hope to see you in the next video, and like and subscribe if you could, and see you hopefully soon. Bye.